Good morning, everyone. I'm so sorry that I didn't end the vlog last night. I actually, surprisingly, fell asleep on the couch. I was sitting up and I fell asleep on the couch watching, um, what was I watching? Because I know wrestling ended and I was still sitting on the couch. So I forget what I was watching. But then, like, I had to run downstairs, grab those last little things that I told you guys about, make my bed, and went to bed. So that's why I didn't end the vlog last night. But it was, like, late. And I was, like, super tired. And then Aubrey woke up at, like, I think it was, like, 2 o'clock in the morning wanting a sip of a drink. And then she went back to bed. So I was like, oh, goodness. Now, you guys, my goal for today is I'm going to see if I can... Because my sister, like I said, my sister's picking me up and we're going to, like, Wag, that Wagman's place. But I'm going to see if we can stop at the library. She can bring me to the library real quick also because um, I have this thing that I have to print out for Aubrey. Um, um, it's like a postage thing that you put on, put on a package. And... Um, you make a hole on the top of it and the elf comes out so i'm gonna do that for aubrey but for now you guys i am gonna get myself some coffee um and then i am um gonna get myself some breakfast and then i'm gonna get some cleaning done my dishes done i want to wash off my counter here and i want to clean up the living room before my sister comes hey guys oh wow bad position i'm sitting here oh my god Sun's like right in my face. Oh, God. Oh, there's my tree, you guys. You guys see my tree? <laughs> there's my tree. But, you guys, so um, my sister says she's coming for 11 o'clock, and it's 10 o'clock now. I'm thinking about taking a walk to the library and getting that printed out. I need to print out for Aubrey. And that could be, like, my walk for the day. Um, I'll just bundle up and wear my layers and everything. But... Huh. So I think I'm going to go for a walk to the library, print that out, and come back. And I'll be home by 11 o'clock. If I go and then come right back. Definitely should be here by 11 o'clock. So I'm going to go brush my hair. I already got into my jeans and my socks and everything. So I'm going to head out and go do that. And I'll see you guys when I come back. Okay, guys. So I went to the library and did everything that I needed to do. And now my sister's here. So I'm leaving with her. So I'll see you guys when I come back. Hey, guys. It is... 246 now i just got back when my sister went to a whole bunch of places and then we came back um so now i am going to what else do i think i should do here what should i do i know i do need to call my stepfather up and see if he can come get these two bags or i might just wait till saturday when he picks aubrey up to give it to him because he said just so he doesn't have to do an extra trip out here it's not it's like right down the road but still but still i might do that um other than that, that's it. I think I'm just gonna, um, I, I know I need to bring down my Christmas tote. I need to do that. So, and I need to vacuum in here. So I'm gonna get that stuff done. But Aubrey's like getting out of school now, but but she has her after school program now. So then I have to leave here at like 5.30, 5.40 to go get her. So I'm gonna get myself something to drink. I finished my coffee and the car. And I'm gonna get something to drink and maybe have a snack and I'll see you guys after. Hey guys, it's six o'clock now, exactly 6.01. Um, I'm gonna start using my dishwasher a little bit more lately just because, um, I, I just am. I'm just gonna start using a little bit more. Um, figure out the settings and everything because like I told you guys last time I used it, it really did not come out good. Like the stuff was still dirty. Um, there was one time when I used it and the soap thing didn't even open up. So I have to look at like the settings and everything on it to see about it. Does this come out? Oh, it does, it does. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna put the baby's bottle in the dishwasher. I got some ramen in the microwave for Aubrey. That's what she wanted for dinner. So I got Aubrey some ramen, cooking in the microwave. 
Um, this dishwasher is not big, you guys. So I'm literally going to put Aubrey's bowl in here from dinner, from her ramen, and then I literally can wash. Well, not really. I think I can fit a couple more things down here at the bottom. And then this thing is filled already. So that's just how it is. Um, it's not like a big one. It's just a small little one here that I have. So it doesn't fit a super lot, but it fits enough. It's enough. So I took all the eggs that I had in my fridge because they really need to get eaten. I really haven't been eating a lot of eggs lately. And for a while back at my old place, I used to eat, me and Frank used to eat a lot of eggs a lot. Um, so I boiled up the rest of the eggs that I have and I did peel them all. I'm going to have a couple for dinner and then I'm going to put the other ones in a baggie for tomorrow, but I'm going to make myself some deviled eggs. I like to put bread and butter pickles on my deviled eggs. So good. So good. Like so good. You guys, you don't even know how good it is. So good. But tomorrow I have the boy. You should have seen him today. You guys, he's so cute. Such a cute boy. Such a cute boy. Oh, I forgot I had this thing here, sitting here. I'm gonna go put this back on the stove real quick. Oh, I'm gonna order this thing off Amazon, you guys, for my stove. I think I showed you guys my stove, but my stove, oh, this is heavy, this is heavy, this is heavy. This is heavy. Um, hold on, you guys. Um, I think I told you guys about my stove, but I have like a gas stove. Um, the top of it is like cast iron top, top things. And I have to cover, like if you guys see my stove right there, I literally have to cover every inch of my stove on top or it will get dirty in the inside. Just from like a little bit of dust. If I'm getting something out of the microwave and a little bit of water drips, it will go right on the stove. So I found this thing on Amazon. It's like $30 though, which I kind of feel like is worth it, but it's a black topper and it's washable. So when I'm cooking and something gets on the bottom part of the stove, it's not touching the actual stove. It's touching the topper and um, I can just take it off and wash it in the sink. And I'm going to get it because I've been needing to get something like that since I've moved in here because it's a pain. Like, I love this. That's, that type of stove is an awesome stove, but it is a pain in the butt to constantly have to clean it all the time. All the time you have to constantly clean it. So I'm going to finally get something to put on there so that I don't always have to have stuff on top of the stove. Um, so... But I'm gonna get a plate up here. I have Aubrey's ramen right here. I just mixed it. Hey, Aubrey, can you come get me your spicy sauce? Can you get it for me, please? Can you get me your spicy sauce, please? Can you get me your spicy sauce, please? Don't bring the ramen over there. It's ramen right here. No, it's not gonna smell like boiled eggs, you silly. You gonna put some in? Is that, is it just a little bit? Be gentle, there's broth in there. A little bit more. There you go, mix it in. And remember, you have to eat more before you get bread. Uh -huh, she likes me to give her some bread for her to dip in like the broth, but I make her eat like most of the noodles before I'll give her any bread. Because then if I give her bread, she just doesn't want to eat the rest of the noodles. So, oh, where's that? This is good. Let's make these deviled eggs. They're going to be so good. So good. And I saw Monica yesterday on Instagram posted a picture that she made a keto pancake. And I haven't had one of those in months. Like, I got to put some more eggs on my Walmart delivery order for Friday. Um, I'm going to do a big Walmart delivery order for Friday. Hopefully, I get majority of the stuff that I ask for. Because you know how it is with Walmart delivery. You don't always get everything that you want. I'm hoping that I do get a majority of it, like I said. So, um, and then Friday, I'll try to, like, I'm going to try and have it come the last hour of the night. Or maybe I'll have it come, like, in the morning or something. Um, at some point where I can have, like, Frank occupy the baby. And I can do a uh, haul for you guys. 
a big haul for you guys of the stuff for the month. Well, it should last. The, the stuff I, there's two recipes I want to make. They're both desserts. One of them is my green stuff recipe that my family loves. And then I've been really wanting um, like some type of pumpkin recipe. So I'm gonna bake, I'm gonna make no bake pumpkin cheesecake, which it's basically a cranberry, cra oh, I can't talk. A cranberry, oh, not cranberry, oh my God. Gran cracker crumb crust, like the ones you can buy at the store that's already pre-made. You take a can of um, pumpkin, a block of cream cheese, and I believe Cool Whip something like that and you mix it all together in a like blender or whatever you mix it all together and then you put it in the container and the, the cram back grand cracker crust you stick it in the fridge i found one where it wants you to freeze it but this one you put stick it in the fridge and then they want you to get they actually want you to get you get two of the small tubs of the cool whip the other tub is supposed to be to put on top of the um, cheesecake after it's done cooling in the fridge. Not cooling, but like coming together more in the fridge. I'm like, oh. I used to make that all the time. Like when I was living with my parents, we used to make it all the time for Thanksgiving. Um, and I haven't had it in a long time and I've been wanting it. So I'm gonna make one. Um, and then I really want some of them, my green stuff. My family recipe, the green stuff. I've been really wanting that. So I'm gonna make a small one of those because I don't really think Frank and Aubrey really like the green stuff. So I don't wanna make a big, like a bigger size one and then have me being the only one to eat it. And my nephew cannot have it, ho 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 ho. He cannot have that. That's way too much, way, way, like all of it is dairy. Basically all of it is dairy except for the, um, the Jello mix. So like, absolutely not. My nephew cannot have that. So trust me, he probably would love it. But he absolutely cannot have it. <laughs> absolutely not. So, and then I need to get, like, more water. We only have, like, two water bottles left in the fridge. I need to get, like, more meat. I need to get more um, goldfish. We have, oh, add a goldfish. Um, let me get my stuff out of here real quick. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Where's my mayonnaise? Oh, I have my mayonnaise. I think I'm all out of mayonnaise in here. But, um... Oh, I got my bread and butter pickles right here. Uh, what else did I think? What else? What else? I'll have to go on my laptop later and tell you guys exactly what I want to order. I'm going to have to tell you guys. Luckily, I always have an extra mayo in my cupboard. Now, this mayo right here, you guys, I think I told you guys this before. But this mayo, um, I have to see if it says anything about lactose or anything like this. But, um, no, no, no. Okay, it says water, soybean oil, fruit starch, modify, whole eggs, sugar, vinegar, salt, contains 2% two per, two or less egg yolks, lemon juice, concentrate, sorbic acid, calcium something, and then natural flavors. And then extracts of paprika, whatever. Um, but, oh God, there's no milk, there's no cream, there's no dairy. It's just eggs and a whole bunch of other stuff. So... Cause I gave my nephew mayonnaise one time and my sister freaked out about it. Oh my God, my sister's something, you guys. She's, I understand that she's the parent. Don't get me wrong. Obviously she makes up, she can say what my nephew can have. Obviously it's her child, but sometimes she just makes no sense with, with how she is. It makes no sense. Like she doesn't want my nephew having cheese curls because he's lactose. But then I was, she was told from his doctor not to have it. But then I was told from Aubrey's doctor that cheese curls are like there's not real cheese and cheese curls so it's not going to do the same effect to a person with that is lactose um then giving them like a cheese stick like a mozzarella stick obviously they have like a mozzarella stick that's going to be really bad but a cheese curl like a fried cheese curl aubrey's doctor told me that that's basically like fake cheese it's not even real that's what her doctor told me like it's not even real cheese. And like my sister's big on not letting Logan have like sweets, which I understand because I was so picky with Aubrey when she was a baby. I didn't even want her to have a cheese curl. I didn't even want her to have McDonald's, none of that. But my sister won't even let my nephew have a cheese curl. He can't even have like um, a pretzel or any of that type of stuff. Like she doesn't want him to have junky type foods. 
But then she feeds him a crap load of pasta. She feeds him a crap load of bread and carbs. And um, she gives him freaking raviolis that have a crap load of salt. I'm like, how does that make any sense? How? And then today, like I was with her today and oh my God, I don't even want to get into that. <laughs> I don't even want to get into that. But today I was like, what was with, we were, went out and I was talking to her about having Logan try avocado. And she's like, oh no, oh no, I don't want him trying that. Me and Dan don't like it, so he don't need it. I'm like, are you serious? So yeah, as you guys know what I'm saying. But I need to um, get off here because I need to delete some videos on here. My phone is getting full. So I'm going to make up my deviled eggs. Um, I'm going to get some videos put together. And I'll see you guys after. Hey guys. I believe it's around 9 o'clock now and I'm in bed. Which is so not like me but i am so tired today which is so weird like i don't know why i've been like so tired lately like all the time i'm tired but because i didn't even have a baby today but i did go out today but that still shouldn't matter but i don't know i'm just tired maybe because you're supposed to be tired at night i don't know but i'm laying here watching lifetime movie and i was texting frank but I'm thinking we're just going to end the vlog here because I'm probably going to eventually lay here and fall asleep. I'm in my bed um, laying down and everything. I'm going to fall asleep. So I already set my alarms and um, everything is situated and where it's, like, it's supposed to be. I'm just going to shut my light off and head to bed. So hope you guys had an awesome day and I'll see you guys tomorrow.